Live from Ground Zero, it's JDK! Don't worry, Lauren, if the car accident couldn't kill me, this petty cold won't. Uh, just a little update for everyone. Uh, 75,000 tickets sold to the Emerald City Comic Con. 10,000 tickets have been refunded. So if you're a stoner like myself, don't worry, there's still passes available. Uh, the good news, too, they've moved it to July. Uh, that being said, uh, if you don't have anything to do, um, the, uh, American Irish, uh, well, you know what? The 14th is still on. Uh, you know, they say alcohol is the cure. That might be why. But for the sober among us, I believe it's because, uh, we love a good fight. You know, this is so bad. You shouldn't be looking at your notes. This is what you get for writing your bits right before you do it. Oh, uh, <laughs> No, seriously, though, uh, speaking of fighting, I went to the Stuck Dan Hope show recently. Aw, uh, Got some great uh, seats. Uh, it's Doug Stanhope. I just call him Doug Stanhope. Uh, I got some great seats, but I should have known something was going to be up because uh, the lovely lady that came up to sit in between us, uh, well, she warned us about dating 25-year-olds. So uh, what ends up happening is uh, about, I'd say, uh, maybe five minutes into the opening comic, uh, they stumble out. And he spills her drink, and that's always fun. Uh, my buddy and I start going back and forth trying to figure out what to deal with her and him. Uh, he says it's probably a Tinder date gone wrong. I kind of agreed with that one. Uh, we tried to decide. Uh, we agreed she probably paid for the tickets. Uh, however, it turned out it was actually an emol and <laughs> it was an annulment gone right. Uh, so she informed me after the show uh, that uh, it's only $125 to buy her freedom back. Uh, so that's wonderful news, uh, you know. Uh, but this uh, this lovely Aryan motherfucker was about this tall, long hair, uh, you know, and uh, he got blacked out drunk, and uh, yeah, you know. And you guys aren't feeling that, so uh, since I, uh, the God gave me the light, uh, I'm going to end on a totally, completely different thing. Uh, I promised my buddy I'd tell a joke I haven't told in a while. Uh, did you all hear about the blind guy during World War II? Yeah, he could not see Nazis. Thank you very much. I've been JDK. Lauren, I'm available. <laughs>